today I'm gonna make some fried tomatoes and dumpling. This is the ingredients: one pepper, three, three green garlic, onion, and oil. That's it. So I'm gonna cut up my tomatoes now. Pot hot in. Good. So I'm washing out my tomatoes. So let it rinse it. Make sure your hand going in the holes. When you're making fried tomatoes, you don't put plenty of seeds. Make sure you wash out most of the seeds. Okay. Now my pot is hot. Going with my onions. So people, do not diss on my pot, okay? My handle, this pot is very valuable to me. Have very sentimental days and times. It come from Trinidad. Over 25 years I had this pot. Okay, don't diss on my kitchen. I don't have no nice kitchen. I just being myself, trying to show the world what I could cook with food to that food. So don't hate on my pot people. That is what you have, that is what you're gonna use, right? I'm a person down to earth. So I'm just gonna cook here now. Probably about 20 minutes. And that's it. So the fried tomatoes finish. So I'm gonna do my dumpling now. the flour for the dumpling so I use four cup of flour a spoon and a half salt for the dumpling no baking powder that's it See, I don't need flour, people. Simple, man. So you can't eat it too soft. If you do, the best have to just put some dry flour back and bring it back a little stiff. Okay. So nobody are perfect. So you see, leave a little soft. Put a little flour. And you need it back.
Here was a little salt, so I bring it back to a little stiff. That's it now. Once it rolls in smooth like this, then you need it. You leave it for a little ten minutes. As we try as well, leave the flour to soak a little bit. Yep. So just now, I'll show you guys how I'm gonna make the dumpling. Yes, guys. So we're gonna make the dumpling now. So you just put some flour on your counter, flatten it a little bit, put a little flour. So this is for the wife. The call is us a little. Spaghetti dumpling. Okay. My dumpling gonna be chato tom, real chili style. But now it come out. That's okay. Call it spaghetti dumpling. So I just cut it. Like this. This for the wife and the kids. I don't know about the cattle tongue dumpling. So try a little oil in the pot. I always do that for the dumpling on the stick. You get a little stir up there. That's it. 20 minutes time. Going for another one. Once it's sticking, I'll put a little flour. Not hard. But wrong and nice. Yep. Put it in the pot. I roll it on plain like this. The flour. Put a split in the middle. Stretch it. Call this cattle tongue, people. If you don't know, cattle tongue dumpling.
plated pole. Say it, people. That's how it, we do it back in the, in the islands. Fetch and pull. That's it. Stir it up there now. Take about 20 minutes. But it finished, show you the finished product. Guys, people are gonna strain the dumpling now. So when it finished, I'll show you the finished product. That's guys, this is the finished product. So this is the dumpling, this is the pasta dumpling for the wifey and the kids and this is the cattle tongue for me, they call this big man food, you know, so I'm going in with the taste guys, so we put some tomatoes, wow, so good man, you guys have to try this, make it at home. To all my viewers out there, friends and family, you guys big me up. Okay, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Okay, it's me Roland. You see me on my another video. Bye.